Hello guys, it is Max Pow here from Ruin Gaming. Gonna show you guys real quick the 5.2 changes that are happening to Warriors in two weeks. So do not forget to cap out all your honor in justice and be sure to upgrade your gear. Warbringer now reduces movement speed by 50% for 15 seconds. That's a really needed. Second win had a little nerf. You can only generate 15 rage over 10 seconds. Shockwave. The biggest nerf for us warriors now. Now it's a 40 second cooldown. But if you strike three or more, it's a 20 second cooldown. Blade Storm can no longer be disarmed. But in my opinion, guys, I think it needs to be buffed up a little bit here. A little weapon damage in a shorter cooldown. But I think more people are going to be able to take Blainstorm over Shockwave next season. Safeguard has not been touched. Stormbullet had a slight buff, but not really noticeable. But now it's a 125% weapon damage. Now for the glyph that I use right now. It's the death from above. It no longer increases damage when using. But it still reduces the cooldown on Heroic Leap by 15 seconds. In my opinion, I think this is still useful for us Warriors next season. Next up, we have Overpower now costs 10 Rage. Ooh, ooh. Up next, we have a little nerf for us Warriors. Defensive Stance has been nerfed by 15%. What is next? I'm looking for it, guys. I'm sorry. Slam has been buffed by 220% weapon damage. Already talked about Stormbolt. Taste for Blood has been redesigned. And I'll make a video, guys, about that in my next videos before the 5.2 patch hits. And I think that is it for now, guys. Be sure to subscribe, like, and leave a comment below. And thanks for watching.